Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Good morning sir. <laughs> You're welcome to our uh, today's lecture on basic dispensing theory one. BDT 152. Good morning. We are still on the topic tablets. We are still on the topic tablets. Components of um, coating solution. Components of coating solution. Yesterday we concluded with the polymers, with the film formers, both the non enteric and the enteric. Today we move over to solvents. We move over to what? Solvent. Remember, the solvent serves as the vehicle for the what? Solution. These other components may be dissolved or dispersed in what? Solvent. Depending on the award, so we do it, right? So, we look at solvent. So, the solvent is actually meant to do what? Dissolve or disperse the polymers and other ad ad additives used in what? Coating what? Solution. So, if we disperse if the solvent disperses or dissolves these um, polymers and other, uh, other additives, it converts them to where the surface of, the, of what you want to do what? Coat. That means it serves as the what? Vehicle. It's not, it, it's not, it, it, not, it does not only dissolve or disperse them, it serves as what? Vehicle. Alright, so now for a solvent to be a very, a very good one for, for, for this um, formulation, we have the requirements, are the properties this solvent should have. Number one is that, the, of course, basically, it should be able to either dissolve or what? Disperse the polymer system. That one is the bas basic feature it should have. And also, it, it, it should also not have any environmental what, impact, mainly the negative aspect. Now, it should also easily do what? Disperse other coating, not just the polymers and the, or, or, or the additive, other coating solution component in the what? Solvent system. So you should do to everything that has to do, that should be in that solution. You should do what? Be able to disperse them, or at least dissolve or disperse them to form a, a, a system. Now, it should also have a rapid drying what rate. Rapid drying what rate. A high rapid drying rate is described as being able to coat up to 300 kilogram load in three to what five hours. Within three to five hours, it should be able to coat up to 300 kilogram what load. It should be what. Colorless, tasteless, odorless, inexpensive, non toxic, inert, and it should not be what? Inflammable. It should not be what? Inflammable. I've already mentioned that it should have a rapid what? Drying what? Rate. Examples we have our normal inorganic one we know, which is what? Water. You start having other ones that are like what? Organic, you start seeing ethanol, methanol, isopropanol, chloroform, acetone, 
methylene chloride, methylene ethyl ketone. These are examples of what solvent used in the formulation of what coating solution. Now let's look at plasticizers. We mentioned plasticizers on several what occasions. So now, now let's say one or two things at least at your level of what plasticizers are. Basically, I said in our last lecture that they are used to do what modify the quality of what the film. They improve the quality of the what the film. True or false? The so now we have some plasticizers, our internal plasticizers. We also have what external what plasticizers. Those ones, the internal ones, are the ones that if you add, they will go and they. In fact, they will chemically bond, bound to the what, to the what, polymers. They will react actually and modify the what, everything that has to do with the what, the polymer. They will react to the what, basically they will form chemical bond, the bond, they will react to the what, of the what, polymers. Now, but the ones that are not, that are external, they, they, they don't do what, react, okay? They don't do what, they modify but not reacting to chart changing anything. In the word, in the word polymer. Are we together? Are we together? So basically, basically, the polymer, this they improve the word, the plasticizer improve the word flexibility, right? The word tensile word strength and what adhesive word property. So sometimes the polymers, the this plasticizer can be up to one to fifty percent of the weight of the word thing from. Are we together? Up to 1 to 50% of the weight of the word thing format. That's the concentration of what the amount of the word, the plasticizers normally what used. Then we have examples. We have we have what castor oil, propylene what glycol, we have glycerin, we have surfactant. If we start going deep, you start seeing different categories of what? Plasticizers, which I don't want to go into. That one is a bit above your level. Start going deep, you start seeing different. You have seen primary, secondary, and what have you, okay? But let's leave it at this level, okay? I wouldn't want to go deeper than this. So, now, then, depending on, on the type of shade you want to, sometimes your target may be light shade, maybe dark or shade. You know, you know what, what, what I mean by shade color, right? Yeah. Maybe if you want to, if you target light shade, then the concentration there will should be around 0.1%. But if you target dark shade, target around what? 2.0 percent. Now, did you find out the meaning of FDC and DC? You did not, right? We did. Okay, what is FDC? DC income. <laughs> Your misplaced that is when? This course is when? The last paper, right? No. Okay. But on the last day, right? No. Alright, let's continue. So, Now let's look at colorants. Let's look at what? Color. Hey. Now, sorry, what did I say now? Sorry, sorry, I mixed up something. Sorry, I mixed up colorants with uh, black color. Please, please, I mixed up something. Let's let's look at what colorant, please. The concentration of plasticizer is always what? 1 to what? 50%. Please note it, okay? Good. If that is for what? The one I mentioned is for what? Colorants. You know, you know colorants are come like a dye or lick of dye. I've seen describe how lick are prepared from where? Dyes. Colorant comes as dye. So the concentration I mentioned, please, is concentration for colorants if you want to use, if you want light or shade and dark or shade. So please, that one, that one has to do with color, not what, not what, the plasticizing property. Please, 
cancel it, please. That was a mistake, please. Okay? Some people are confused. Yes. I said I mentioned light shade. After describing um, placenta, I started with light shade. I said that light shade. I said, no, that, that is for what? Colorants, not what? Plasticizers. I've already mentioned the concentration of what? Plasticizer to me, which is 1 to 1, 50%. So please correct it. That, that's what I say. Can I, those that actually put down things while, I'm, while, while I talk, please correct it. Okay? That is not for what? Plasticizers. Concentration for plasticizers is 1 to 1, 50%. So it's the only program to start talking talk, talk, talk about shades, light shades, dark shades. So those concentrations I mentioned there, 0.01 percent for light shade and 2.0 percent for dark shade. That is for tolerance, not plasticizers, please. Now let's look at what tolerance. So of course, tolerance are used to do what provide distinct color and what elegance on the dosage form. It's just for aesthetic what. Value okay, even though to some extent identification, but that is not the best way of what and it's because some drugs may have the same what and the coated with the same color, so you cannot say because this one is yellow, any tab any coated tablet that is yellow with this drug, you're making a mistake. True of us, it's not the best way, even though to, to some extent it can serve, but it's not the best way to do that. But basically, it's for what elegance, okay, for what elegance make it to distinct and for elegance that is aesthetic what value now so it's used to do what okay to, to, to achieve what if you want to achieve proper distribution of suspended coloring on the co co on the coating solution it's better to use what fine powder if you want to achieve listen carefully can we relate this statement now with what we discussed about surface area if you want to achieve proper distribution of what the suspended colorant is better to use fine powdered colorant so that fine powder colorant what happens to the surface area does it have a, a, a an increased surface area or a decreased surface area something that is a powder that is fine does it have an increased surface area or decreased surface area <laughs> So, because it has increased surface area, it will give a better what distribution. True of us, true of us. So that's the point we are trying to make here. That if you want to get having a proper distribution of the word colorant, use what fine powdered word colorant. Meaning size of less than ten words micro. Size of ten less than ten words micro. Are we together? Are we together? Yes. Good. So, so, how do we now know the concentration of the colorants to use? So, the concentration of colorants in the what? Depends on the color shade. So, we are going back, back to, to, to that mistake I made before. The, con the concentration to use depends on the what? Color shade you want to achieve, okay? So, the concentration of colorants in the coating solution depends on the color shade, the desired type. Of dye, at the same time, concentration of the word upper quantum extenders. We wish that something is upper quant. What does it pre what, 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 what does it pro provide? Okay, right? Not clear, not you can see through it, right? At least it, it provides a shade at all that you cannot see through it. That's where the upper quant came from. Are we together now? So we are saying that concentration of the of the colorant you want to use depends on this three. One, the shade, you have this color shade you want to achieve, right? Then the type of what? Dye. And what? Of the upper quant what? Standard. Now, now, if you want to achieve light, let me not go back to that mistake I, I made. For now, if you want to achieve light what very light shade, concentration should be around what 0.01 percent. Are we together? Then, if you want to achieve dark shade, it should be around what 2.0 percent. So, all the colorants, the colorant to be used must and have to be certified by what 
food and drug what? Cosmetics. Or drug and cosmetics what? So they should be food and drug, food, drug and cosmetics what? Colorant. So F, D, and C. And it could be what? Drug and what? Cosmetics. <laughs> Easy, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. But it's is, is, is good the way you look for it. Yes. Yes, it's good. So you now appreciate it now, right? Yes. Good. yes. Now, now let's go. So the dye, the, these dyes can be used as dyes, can also be used as what? Lakes. Okay? Lakes or and dyes. Lakes are produced from where? Dyes. Are we together? Lakes are produced from where? Dyes. So dyes are more natural, true of us. But you can get lakes from where? Yeah. Die. So, lakes are derived by precipitation. If you precipitate the dyes using what? Carriers. Example of such carriers are what? Alumina or tile. If you use carriers like alumina or tile, you produce a lake what? You, you, you produce lakes. So, so these um, some of, some of these inorganic materials on a natural colorant as follows. We have here what iron oxide. Is iron oxide in, 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 inorganic? Yes. Is this inorganic? Yes. So we have caramel. We have carotenoid. We have chlorophyll, indigo, flavones, turmeric, carminic acids. These are examples of what the colorants we can use. That's maybe it's not what maybe. And from there now you can get it. Hmm. Extracted from it, okay? Chlorophyll, this the dye is extracted from here. Chlorophyll. chlorophyll has pigment now, right? Yes. That, that, this dye are extracted from these things, okay? okay? So from there you can now, if you want to prepare a lake, a lake, you can now do what? You, 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 cannot, you, you cannot do what? Extract. If you want to prepare a lake, what, what would you do? Precipitate with what? Yes. Hey, hey. Yes. Examples. Yes. Now, those that are, that are commercially available, the brands that are commercially available, we have things like up, upper locks. Upper locks. Upper locks is upper quant color concentrate. It's used for what? Sugar. Sugar upper locks. For what? Sugar protein. Upper spray for what? Pink protein. Upper dry for what? <laughs> okay now. Upper dry for what? Complete film coating. So, so upper spray for film coating, right? Yes. Upper loss is for what? Sugar coating. Upper spray is for what? Film coating. Now, let's conclude this with upper quant what? Extender. Upper quant what? Extenders. Upper quant what? Extenders. So, what happens to upper quant extenders? They are actually very fine inorganic powders that are used in coating what? Solution formulation. What do they do? They provide more pastel colors and increase film coverage. What is pastel colors? What do you understand by the term pastel? Or pastel. What does it? What do you understand by the term pastel? Shiny. Shiny. Uh huh. Uh huh. What? Say it now. Pastel. What does it mean? Shiny. No. Faint. Is that what? Wait, no. You can have, you can get like, like if you see blue, you see a blue that is very dark, right? You see another blue that is what light. light. So it talks about light, light color, light, light version of a particular, of a particular what color. So pastel colors are light. Okay, okay. Pastel colors are light colors. Sky blue is it pastel? Yes. Do you understand what I mean by pastel colors? So yes. now. What happens is that these they are very fine inorganic powders used in coating solution to formulate co coating solution. 
in order to provide more pastor what? Colors. And increase fame of it. And increase what? Fame of it. Good. So they provide what? White coating. And at the same time, match the color of what? The tablet of down is normal. So examples of uh, opaquant extenders are we have titanium dioxide, silicates. Silicates. Example of silicates used here, we have aluminium what? Silicates. We also have carbonates. We have magnesium what? Carbonates. We also have sulfates. We have casual what? Sulfates. We have casual what? Sulfates. So these things, they are example, money. these are examples of what? Uh, what do you call? Oh, wow. So we are done with this now. We are done with what? Component of what? Coating solution. Now let's look at how we introduce this and stop this lecture here. Tomorrow we'll continue. We look at equipment for coating, okay? Equipment for coating. In our next lecture, we we'll look at these three equipments for coating. So, I've, I've introduced this, so please read, read it up, okay? Yes, sir. Before tomorrow. Read up these equipment for what? Put it. I'll just introduce them, then you read them up, how they work, and one or two things about them. So, by God's grace, that tomorrow we will look at how to evaluate what? Coated tablets. That is a test for what? Coated tablets. Then, after that, we'll conclude with what? Coating defects. We conclude with what? So, we conclude with what? Coating the facts. We are missing the start from Tuesday, right? Yes. So, Monday is not true. Let's go on Monday. No time to waste. Monday we have lecture for quiz Monday. Each of us, it's not compulsory. But our animal lecture was hood. More Monday, then our lecture by two must also do us who. Then our quiz, our fourth quiz will who. So after your miss semester, the following week we continue from where we. Maybe by God's will, by that next week we enter. With next two weeks, next two weeks, right? We enter the capsules. We enter capsules. Then we now conclude with your suppositories. So your OBJ, you are you are missing the exam is OBJ. Not you. Fifty of the day. Not you. 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 Not it depends on the lecture. But there must be what? At least. A little bit said to give on the lecture. At least. So, if I like now, I may, I may, I may go back now and, and give you 100. If I like. 50 is just the minimum, right? So, if I like, I may give you 50 OBJ questions for SA to answer to. It's my choice. It's my what? Choice. So get prepared. I can have a question. Actually, I am a Now, the good pants for what? Coating. Here, yeah, number one, we have our what? Conventional slash what? Standard coating fan system. So we have the conventional slash what standard coating fan system. Then we also have perforated fan system. Then we have what fluidized bed system. We have what fluidized bed system. We have what 
Ludice better system. Ludice better system. Please read these things. Bob, I want you to go through these things. Go through them, okay? The question for you are for your what is it called? Miss Mester will be Ramu. Listen carefully. Listen carefully now. Listen carefully now. We we'll finish this. We, we, you questions from come from powders, granules, and what tablets. tablets. So the tablet, the last topic we do in tablet is evaluation of tablet generally. Okay, I'll say it's not here. I'll, I'll, I'll stick with material for that one. Evaluation of tablet as general. This one is for coated what? The one here is for what? Coated what? Tablet. So on, on a general note, the evaluation. We have done tablet defect on, on the general note, right? Yes, sir. Right. So we still do tablet the coat, ta defect is coated what? Because not all tablets are what? Coated. Yes. True, of course. Yes. So now, the same way we, 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 we end this particular material with uh, Defect of what coated tablet. We also do generally defect in what and how to swallow what tablets. How to do what swallow wow. tablets. I think, I think that will be the end. If there's any other thing in the outline that is not mentioned here, we will conclude that by Monday. So tablet is ending by Monday. But if I finish before Monday, I'll enter capsule. I say if I finish tablet, all this that I discussed about, I told you about tablet. If I finish before Monday, I'll enter camps. But what you expect for your business is what? Powders, you know what Tablet. No question will come from capsule. Capsule and subsidiary will, will contribute 60 something percent of your exam question. So if you like, play. See, certain percent will come from, of examples will, will come from capsule and what? So the the thirty percent will come down from, will come from where tablets, guns and what? I have laid it bare now. So if you like, you study. Okay. So if you like, you study. All right. I think we we'll stop here for now. See you tomorrow, by God's grace. Thank you, sir. 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 Thank you